our channel since the coming and dying world and today we will discuss about this face blend and with the, this face blend we can blend or we can apply the bleed between two faces and first one is this it select body face so just reset this and change this body face to single face and my first face is this and second face is this and the fillet will come you can see here the fillet will come automatically uh, a much radius is here and lesser radius is here and review this you can see the output will come like this the radius will come automatically a little bit less at the end of this point or if you want to keep the constant radius with the help of this constant value you can define this constant radius here double click this and so just change the width as 6 and width method I will change it to automatically and now this looks good and for my next option in face blend we have this third contact curve contact curve for this method I have to create two curve uh, which will define as a limit of my fillet so let's select this first face uh, change it to wireframe so that the end edges will show properly and print the curve change it to shading mode again define second curve at the second face and again I select I draw a next curve now I will use this this face blend with the help of this face blend we can blend two face so change it to single face first face is this and click second face is this and my fillet will come like this or you can change it to 12 and show the preview you can see it is just similar to edge blend but now I want to change this width method to contact curve contact will curve will make the contact with the curve you can see okay and just click okay the result will like this and this is if you want to see it properly just go to the section and create a new cut section and Here you can see this is my solid portion okay so it will create a solid fillet if you are using it on the surface so that time it will create only surface if you are using it on the solid faces then it creates a solid fillet 